I'm fired up about this um, Logan Paul situation. Yep. In the suicide force, I'm trying to plant the proper heat at the proper moment. Right. I feel as if it started kind of like, oh my God, I'm shocked. This person straight up committed suicide in the forest. Then I heard some, you know, words of wisdom because their audience is what, kids 13 to 17. Right, yep. Very poor job of editing. Right. Let it roll a little too long. Some laughter came about, which should have never happened in that moment. Right. And some people argue shit you even had posted. Definitely a visual of the body. Especially the video shot when it was like hands down, you yeah. see the hands balled up. And that's a little too graphic, especially for his audience. So people are killing him. Guys like uh, Aaron Paul, people like Sophie Turner, people like Pierce Morgan are slamming him saying he's a piece of human garbage. And the fact that he went to the forest, a place called Suicide Forest, people in Japan have gone there, lots of people have gone there to commit suicide. They even made a movie about it called The Forest. He goes there to shoot a YouTube segment, wearing a goofy green hat, knowing that there was a real possibility that he was gonna see a dead body. He actually sees one, he reacts, at first he's serious like he said, then he starts la laughing and goofing around. Then he goes back and edits it and puts it online. You think that's okay? One, I don't know if he thought he was gonna see a dead body. Come on. According to him. Why else would he go there? So I don't wanna jump into this man's mind and tell him what he was thinking, but once you see the dead body, we need to sit down and take a real moment. I know you, mean, you got all those subscribers, you got all those followers, you're making all these big moves. If your ass don't have a PR person, brother, you need one. When I watched the video, after reading about it first, I initially thought that it was gonna be him taking pictures next to the body, laughing and joking and making a mockery of it. In the beginning, it actually started out heartfelt, like he was trying to say, you know, I can't believe this, you know, this is this has never happened to me in 400 and XYZ blogs. But then after that, a little bit of, no laughter should be in the video. Now, right. it's not, ain't nothing funny. Right. So no laughter should yeah. have taken place. But don't you think once he goes back and he watches this video and he sees himself with a stupid green hat on and they're kind of mocking the situation to point to, it, it, it undermines the raw emotion that he was trying to show at the beginning. And it, 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 you know, it looks like it's all a bunch of bull crap. It was actually his um, sidekick that was giving the emotion. Right. He didn't really give out those bars. Because you know about, what he's thinking in his head? Yeah. Views, views, views. He's thinking people are gonna love this. It's the first on YouTube yeah. because we're showing a dead body in Suicide Damn. Forest. You know what? Now that you put it that way, he might have been a little too greedy for the for the views, trying to get the subscriptions and the views. And if your kid wants to wants to watch Logan Paul now, what do you do? You let him watch it? Yo ass watch some Logan Paul, give me them Jordan 11s, <laughs> give me that PlayStation 4, 3, Xbox One, Xbox X, all the video games. Go to your room, turn off the lights and look at the corner and count the dust mics. So you're over them. Uh, hey, so now Logan Paul's banning your house. My kids cannot watch that.